Welcome to this service. At entrance you should tell, Heavenly Father God, let your mercy be upon us. Give the deaths peace and rest. Give the churches unity and give the world peace. Amen, Amen, Amen. The two paths. If someone does not do what wicked people tell him to do, if he does not join with sinners, if he does not meet with those who laugh at God, God has blessed that person. He is happy when he obeys the law of the Lord. He thinks about God's love during the day and at night. He will become like a tree that grows beside streams of water. It gives its fruit at the right season. Its leaves do not fall off. Everything that person does will have a good result. But wicked people are so are as empty as calf chaff. The wine blows them away, so they will not go free when God judges them. Sinners cannot join with God's people, the people who are right with God. The Lord takes care of people who respect Him, but wicked people are living in a way that will take them to a bad end. Let us pray the prayer of preparation. Almighty God, to whom all hearts are open, all desires known, and from whom no secret are hidden, cleanse the thoughts of our heart by the inspiration of your Holy Spirit, that we may perfectly love you and worthily magnify your holy name, through Christ our Lord. Amen. Prayer of Penitence God so loved the world that he gave his only son Jesus Christ to save us from our sins, to be our advocate in heaven, and to bring us to eternal life. Let us confess our sins in penitence and faith, firmly resolved to keep God's commandments and to live in love and peace with all. Confession Father eternal, giver of light and grace, we have seen in what we have taught, in what we have said and done, through ignorance, through weakness, through our own deliberate fault. We have wounded your love and married your images in us. We are sorry and ashamed and re repent of all our sins for the sake of your Son Jesus Christ, who died for us, forgive us all that is past and lead us uh, out from darkness to walk in children of light. Amen. Gloria, Gloria in excelsis Deu. Gloria, Gloria in excelsis Deu. Glory to God in the highest and peace to his people on earth. Lord God, Heavenly King, Almighty God and Father, we worship you, we give you thanks, we praise you for your glory. Gloria, Gloria in excelsis Deu. Gloria, Gloria in excelsis Deu. Jesus, Lord Jesus Christ, only Son of the Father, Lord God, Lamb of God, you take away the sin of world. Have mercy on us. You are seated at the right hand of the Father. Receive our prayer. For you alone are the Holy One. You alone are the Lord. You alone are the Most High, Jesus Christ, with the Holy Spirit in the glory of God the Father. Gloria, Gloria. In excelsis Deu, Gloria, Gloria, in excelsis Deu, Amen. The Lord's King rules. Why are nations making plans to turn against the Lord? All their plans will fail. Kings and rulers decide to work together to fight against the Lord and the King. That we had chosen. They say we will 
will not accept their authority over us. We will get free from their power. The Lord who sits on his throne in heaven laughs at them. He says that their plans are useless. Then he becomes very angry and he frightens them. He warns them with strong words and he says, I have put my king on his throne in Zion. I have put him on my holy mountain. The Bible, the baptism of Jesus, Jesus in Matthew chapter 3. Isaiah told John the Baptist is a voice shouting in the wilderness, prepare the way for the Lord's coming and clears the road of him. John told to Pharisees, I baptize people with water to brush their sins and turn them to the God. But Jesus will baptize with the Holy Spirit and with fire. Jesus went to John and required baptism. But John told, I am the one who needs to be baptized by you. But Jesus replied, It should be done, for we must carry out all that God requires. After baptism, God opened the heaven. The Holy Spirit as a dove sat on Jesus' shoulder and a voice said, This is my dearly loved Son who brings me great joy. This is the word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Hallelujah. 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 Epistle. The Brave Romans Letter 1, Part 1 to 7. This letter is from Paul, a slave of Christ Jesus, chosen by God to be an apostle and sent out to preach his good news. God promised this good news long ago through his prophets in the Holy Scriptures. The good news is about his son. In his earthly life, he was born into King David's family line and he was shown to be the son of God when he was raised from the dead by the power of Holy Spirit. He is Jesus Christ our Lord. Through Christ God has given us the privilege and authority as apostles to tell Gentiles everywhere what God has done for them so that they will believe and obey him bringing glory to his name and you are included among those gentiles who have been called to belong to jesus christ i am writing to all of you in rome who are lord by god and are called to be his own holy people may god our father and the Lord Jesus Christ give you grace and peace. This is the word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Hallelujah. 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 Gospel. Matthew 10. Part 16 to 22. Jesus told, Look, I am sending you out as sheep among wolves. So be shred as snakes and harmless as doves. But beware, for you will be handed over to the courts and will be flogged with whips in the synagogues. You will stand trial before governors and kings because you are my followers but this will be your opportunity to tell the rulers and other believers about me when you are arrested don't worry about how to respond or what to say god will give you the right words 
at the right time for it is not you who will be speaking it will be the spirit of your father speaking through you a brother will betray his brother to death a father will betray his own child and children will rebel against their parents and cause them to be killed and all the nations will hate you because you are my followers but everyone who endures to the end will be saved glory be to you O Lord hallelujah 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 I will tell you what the Lord has promised to me he is king my son, yes, today I have become your father. Ask me and see what I will do. I will give you all the nations on the earth. They will all belong to you. You will break them with an iron uh, scepter, as if they are clay pots. So now, by very, be very careful. You who rule the nations of the world, learn this lesson. Respect the Lord and serve Him. Enjoy His rule with fear. Bend down low in front of His Son. If not, the Lord will be angry. He will quickly become very angry. You will suddenly die. But as for those who serve the Lord as their king. He blesses them and he takes care of them all. I am preaching only in the form of prayer. Be born again by baptizing yourself. Believe in God and Jesus, Son of God, your Lord. Trust to the Lord and Jesus when you are worried. Have faith to the God and Jesus when you are afraid. Have hope in the God and Jesus with their timing. Let always God and Jesus judge for they know how they can turn evil to victory in your life. Let always God and Jesus bring you from the storm and give peace to your life. Let God's, God's and Jesus' mercy be upon you. Let God and Jesus make you brave to stop evil people and correct them to the right way. Amen. The Creed We believe in one God, the Father, the Almighty, maker of heaven and earth, of all that is seen and unseen. We believe in one Lord, Jesus Christ, the only Son of God, eternally begotten of the Father, God from God, light from light, true God from true God, begotten, not made, of one being with the Father, through him all things were made. For us and for our salvation he came down from heaven, was incarnate from the Holy Spirit and the Virgin Mary, and was made a man. For our sake he was crucified under Pontius Plate. This, uh, he, he suffered death and was buried. On the third day he rose again in accordance with the scriptures. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of the Father. He will come again to glory to judge the living and the dead, and his kingdom will have no end. We believe in the Holy Spirit, the Lord, the giver of life, who proceeds from the Father and the Son, who with the Father and the Son is worshipped and glorified, who has spoken through the prophets. We believe in one holy apostolic church. We acknowledge one baptism for the forgiveness of sins. We look for the resurrection of the dead and the life of the world to come. Amen.
a morning sun. Lord, every day I have more enemies. Many people fight against me. They say about me, God will not save him. But Lord, you are like a shield for me. You are the one who makes me great. You lift my head up high. I called aloud to the Lord. He answered me, his holy mountain. I lie down and I sleep. Then I wake up because the Lord takes care of me. Even if 10,000 enemies all are around me to attack me, I will not be afraid of them. Lord, stand up, my God. Save me from my enemies. Hit all my enemies in the face. Break the teeth of those bad people. Lord, it is you that saves us. You bless your people. Hallelujah. Amen. Prayers of intercessions. We pray for the whole world to solve their conflicts and live in peace and grace. Thanks, Lord, hearing and answering our prayers. We pray for all poor countries. Give them rain and let them use it usefully to make food. Thanks, Lord, hearing and answering our prayers. We pray for sick people. Please heal them and let them know your miracles and let them adore you. Thanks, Lord, hearing and answering our prayers. Amen. The peace. We are the body of Christ. In the one spirit, we were all baptized into one body. Let us then pursue all that makes us for peace and builds up our common life. The peace of the Lord be always be with you. Amen. Preparation of taking the bread and wine. You must have a piece of bread and a glass of uh, non-alcoholic wine, wine or water. Blessed are you, Lord God of all creation. Through your goodness, we have this bread to set before you, which earth has given and human hands have made. It will become for us the bread of life. Blessed be with God. Blessed are you, Lord God of all creation. Through your goodness, we have this wine to set before you, fruit of the wine and work of human hands. It will become for us the cup of salvation. Blessed be God forever. Your Lord is the greatness the power, the glory, the splendor, and the majesty for everything in heaven and on earth is yours. All things come from you, and of your own do we give you. The Lord is here, his spirit is with us. Lift up your hearts. We lift them up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right to give thanks and praise. Amen. It is indeed right. It is our duty and our joy at all times and in all places to give you thanks and praise. Holy Father, Heavenly King, Almighty and Eternal God, through Jesus Christ, your Son, our Lord. 
for he is your living word through him you have created all things from the beginning and formed us in your own image through him you have freed us from the slavery of sin giving him to be born of a woman and to die upon the cross you raised him from the dead and exalted him to your right hand of high through him you have sent upon us your holy and life-giving spirit and made us a, a people for your own possessions therefore we angels and archangels and with all the company of heaven we proclaim your great and glorious name forever praising you and singing holy 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 lord god of power and might heaven and earth are full of your glory Hosanna in the highest blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord Hosanna in the highest accept our praises heavenly father through your son our salvation Jesus Christ and as we follow his example and obey his command grant that by the power of your Holy Spirit these gifts of bread and wine may be to us his body and his blood who is in the same night that he was betrayed took bread and gave you thanks he broke it and gave it to his disciples saying take eat this is my body which is given for you do this in remembrance of me in the same way after supper he took the cup and gave you thanks he gave it to them saying drink this all of you this is my blood of the new covenant which is shed for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins do this as often as you drink it in remembrance of me therefore heavenly father we remember this offering of him, himself made once for all upon the cross we proclaim his mighty resurrection and glorious ascension we look for the coming of our kingdom and with this bread and this cup of uh, cup we make the memorial of Christ your son our Lord amen Christ is risen Christ will come again amen accept through him our great high lord this our sacrifice of thanks and praise and as we eat and drink these holy gifts in the presence of your divine majesty renew us by your spirit inspire us with your love and unite us in the body of your son jesus christ our lord through him and with him and in him in the unity of the Holy Spirit with all who stand before you in the earth and heaven we worship you Father Almighty in songs of everlasting praise blessing and honor and glory and power be yours forever and ever Amen the lord's prayer our father in heaven hallowed be your name your kingdom come your will be done on earth as in heaven give us today our daily bread forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us 
Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power and glory and are yours, now and forever. Amen. If you are many, break the bread and share with each other. Though we are many, we are one body, because we all share in one bread. Son of God, you take away the sin of the world, have mercy on us. Son of God, you take away the sin of the world, have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sin of the world, grant us peace. Amen. Giving of communion. Most merciful Lord, your love compels us to come in. Our hands were unclean, our hearts were unprepared. We were not fit even to eat this crumb, the crumbs from under your table. But you, Lord, are the God of our salvation and share your bread with sinners so cleanse and feed us with the precious body and blood of your son that he may live in us and we in him and that we with the whole company of Christ may sit and eat in your kingdom Amen God's holy gifts for God's holy people Jesus Christ is holy. Jesus Christ is Lord to the glory of God the Father. Amen. You can eat the bread and drink the wine or water. If it is water you are drinking, you can uh, ask Jesus to turn as wine in your body. The peace of God, which passes all understanding, keep your hearts and minds in the knowledge and love of God, and of His Son Jesus Christ our Lord, and the blessing of God Almighty, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit be among you and remain with you always. Amen. It is the end of the service. Go in peace to love and serve the Lord. In the name of Jesus, Amen. An evening song. God, please answer my me when I call aloud for help. You are the one who shows that I am right. Help me in my troubles. Show me that you are kind. Listen to me when I pray. Tell me this, you people. How long will you refuse to respect me? How long will you love stupid ideas? How long will you agree with lies? The Lord is very kind to those who serve him. He has chosen them to belong to himself, so he listens when I pray to him. Shake with fear and stop doing wrong things. Lie on your bed and think about these things. Be sad about the bad way that you live. Offer the right sacrifices to the Lord. Continue to trust in Many people say, will anyone do a good thing for us? Lord, let your face smile on us. You have made me very happy. I am happier than anyone who has lots of food and wine. I will lie down and I will sleep in peace. You, Lord, are the one who takes care of me and you keep me safe. Hallelujah. Amen. 
at exit you should tell I give over my past to the mercy of God my presence for the love of God and my future of God's protection Amen